Hey guys, my name is Ethan. This is Ethan Plays, and today we're continuing the Paper Mario Let's Play. And uh, so we just finished up with uh, Dry Dry Ruins, so we have to get out of Dry Dry Desert. So pretty much you can just walk. Whoa, okay, that was close. You can just walk uh, as far left and then as far down as possible. Let's see, can I go any further left? Can I? No, I can't. All right, so we just need to go down now, I believe. Yeah, just need to go down. And, uh, oh, couldn't miss that bandit. All right, I have to take out these, these guys. Um, I dropped my, uh, my hammer for, uh, like a dizzy attack sort of thing. I don't know. Anyway, let's use the hammer. All right. That actually doesn't kill them. Uh, <laughs> thought maybe that would get a guy. Oh, okay. We have one guy down. And... No, I can't defend it. There we go. Alright. So these guys are going to run with my coins unless I deal with them. So let's go ahead and deal with them. Okay, that was early. I missed that. But they only have five, five HP, excuse me. And that guy. That. Okay. I can deal with this. And I need to be using my hammer that. <laughs> my hammer's upgraded. So. I need to use my hammer. That was not smart at all. Oh, but I got the defense. Alright. So let's use my hammer. And that guy's finished. We're not that far from another level. So we're at 94 star points right now. Six more. Oh, okay, that guy nearly got me. Nearly got me. Oh, okay. So let's continue heading down. And uh, we, need to call we need to talk to this guy. Um, I forgot his name. Okay. So, we're going to give him the artifact that we found in Dry Dry Ruins, and he is going to give us a, a star piece. So that's about it for the desert. Um, we're going to head back to the left, leave the desert, and head back to Mount Rugged. Alright, after we regen what we need to, let's get out of here. We need to go back to Toad Town ultimately, but we're going to make a couple stops along the way. So, this might be another kind of in between episode. Now, is this bird going to be here again? If so, I know what to do. Nope, he's not. Alright. Okay, didn't mean to fall down. Left, not going to happen. Not going to happen. Alright, let's keep moving to the left. And there's a cleft. Don't have to worry about it. Now there is a cleft, yeah, down here at the bottom of these steps. So <laughs> need to be careful as you walk down that, but it shouldn't be a problem. Alright. Um, I don't believe there's anything over here. I'm pretty sure I got this. No, I didn't actually. Quake hammer. Okay. Uh not really useful ooh that was close not really useful for the purposes I need if that made any sense <laughs> okay so we need to go left this is where we met Paracarry that was really close ooh you know what coins I'll always take them so let's let's go for a ride here we go alright that was worth it let's keep moving left alright this is where we meet Paracarry so we need to move left, continue going left, and break this block that we can now break. And there's going to be another, um, uh, what's the word for this? Okay, super block. 
Yeah, super block. All right. Who do we want to upgrade? He'll get charge. He'll get airlift. Um, I mean, pair carry. I'm really not going to use Gumbaria, so. We might as well go with pair carry. Gumbaria is useful for the first chapter, and that's about it, as far as I can tell. So. Alright. So let's get back on the train and head back to Toe Town. Alright, do I talk to you? Yeah, I do. Okay. Alright. Okay, so we're going to look at a few badges in town um, at the badge shop because I have more coins now. Perhaps buy something? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um. But yeah, we have a couple things that we want to fight. I didn't do it after the first chapter, but there's a blooper you can fight below Toe Town. So, uh, anyway, we're going to go to that. Um, now there should be two bloopers, or maybe it's been replaced by another blooper. I'm not sure. There, the first chapter you can fight a normal blooper. The second chapter you fight an electro blooper. I'm not sure if one replaces another after round um, after each chapter I'm not sure how that works I've actually never fought these before I don't believe I really didn't explore much when I first played it I just played through it <laughs> so I did what was necessary and not just everything and once again we're not going to 100% the game in this uh, in this let's play either so anyway but we are going to go fight the enemies that we can fight uh, let's go Okay, this is the sewer, I believe. Yeah, okay. I want to go up to the shop first. Okay, and I'm probably going to move around some badges before I go down. But anyway, let's run up here, take a look. All right, multi-bounce, jump on all enemies in a row. I want that, I think. Increases the distance Mario can spin dash. Or disables an enemy's defense power and injures it. Hmm. I want this one, but I want that one as well. Uh, okay. All right. We're going to go with this. All right. So only one BP for this badge. So that is great. Now, does he automatically restock? How quickly does he restock? Not on the Mac. All right, that's fine. Let's take a look at badges. Um, multi bounce. I want that badly. So I don't know what the dizzy tag actually does. So we're gonna disable that. And I might turn on quake hammer or close call. Um. Or smash charge I mean with the hammer that I have now we are we're looking pretty good uh, all right so we need to go back down to the sewers and fight this blooper I'm not sure which one it's going to be so we're gonna find out all right we can't access that quite yet however we can access that. If we go right, though, there's a normal block. Okay, yeah. So we do fight both bloopers, I think. I don't know what these blocks are about. Is that an order? Um, I don't actually know what those do. So I'm not going to hit them. Do I fight anything? Yes, I do. Okay. All right. So I find a normal blooper if I go right. And if I go left, I'll fight the electro. All right. Nice. Okay. This is, uh, let's see. Do I attack with this? No. All right. So we're going to go power jump. This guy should not take long, I would think. I might even no I'm like I'm not gonna spin my stuff I don't really want to go back up again 
if possible. Uh, oh, no. That was a complete miss. <laughs> All right. Let's power jump this guy. I might actually go back up. We'll see. This guy should not take long, this blooper. Uh, still only two attack power. Nope, early. That was early. Yeah, I'm going to have to go back up for sure. Okay. He has more health than I thought he did. Oh, there's a three. Okay, I guess I was just missing the action command. Oh, missed it again. All right. Hopefully he doesn't have any big attack. <laughs> Otherwise, I could be in trouble. I don't think he does, though. And he should be very close. Come on. Okay. Same attack, different form. Um... All right, I guess we're using refresh. Don't really have much of a choice. That's the only thing. My my health is a little bit low. I will admit. So, I think that's going to uh, that's going to be our next upgrade for sure. All right, there we go. I thought that was probably his last shot, but you never know. All right, here's the upgrade, and it's going to be HP. Because I need it. <laughs> All right. Let's take a look here. Shrink stomp. Not too interested, but whatever. Okay, so actually, I don't need to go up, I believe, because yeah, that that regenerated everything. So I'm not sure what those blocks are about. I don't actually know what those do. So we'll come back to that when and if I find out. <laughs> so let's go here. All right, another blooper. This is an electro blooper. Okay, now it's a good thing I have paracarry. I don't, can I jump on this guy? I'm not sure if he's electrode right now. I don't know, I'm not gonna take a chance. Uh, if, if you shell shot this guy, the electro blooper, you will actually de electrify him. So apparently, he wasn't actually elect electrode at that time, which is what I thought. I can't tell. Whoa. Oh, okay. We get. What do we get? Increases attack power. Yes. Nice. Oh, okay. He's got more oomph. Not a whole lot more, but more. Okay, apparently that attack power thing was one one time. <laughs> All right, I need to hold on to FP because this guy's got Electrum Shelf right now. Okay, that's a little bit obvious. <laughs> I wasn't sure if it was going to be that obvious, but it is. All right, that de-electrifies him, allows me to jump on him again. He's close. He's got to be close. Oh, close. Close. Everything's close. All right. <laughs> Let's use the power jump. Hopefully he won't electrify again because I don't have shell shot anymore. Don't do it. No, 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 no. All right. Um... Well, this leaves me to where I can't actually do anything. So, if I use Refresh, that'll give me enough FP to shell shot. So, let's do that. Might as well. I mean, I just got a level. And I'm going to go up and sleep before I go, before I continue on. So, might as well. How much does this actually use? Okay, so I can actually do it twice if necessary. But I don't think that'll be necessary. Come on. Yes, got the defense there, nice. I'm calling it defense and that's not true, but <laughs> whatever. All right, you've gotta be, you've got to be close, come on. Oh, you're gonna do it again. Okay, well, I'm glad I have, wait, oh, I used the power jump. <laughs> Well, might as well use refresh again. 
Just keep on doing it. I mean, I'm <laughs> just, I'm not even probably a mile away from the, a mile. It's not really measurements in Mario, but whatever. Um, there we go. 22. Not too bad. Um, I'm really close to the shop, so I should be good. All right, so this is going to allow me, using these pipes, to, um, it's going to allow me to return to all the places we've been so far. So, uh, yeah. All right, so uh, we need to go into this room. We can grab all this. That's a snowman doll. And that's a coin. All right, so let's jump in here. Go up here, through this pipe. All right, so we need to go back right. And yeah, there's some Goobas. I'm gonna let them drop down. And I'm actually stuck. So, yeah. Oh, run. Wait. Okay, yeah, I can get back up. I was going to say, I think I can get back over, over here, and I can. All right, let's wait for these to balance themselves out. Go back right. There's this platform. I need paracarry. Ooh, that was close. All right, star piece. Grab that. Um, okay. Didn't know there was anybody down here. Didn't know. Okay, multi bounce. Perfect. Everybody on the ground. This is where Cooper would have been nice, but you know, whatever. Wow, these guys actually have some oomph. If I can defend them, though. Nice. All right, uh, what are these? It's a Gloomba, okay, I was gonna say. It's either a Dark Goomba or a Gloomba. Wow, they have some serious health. Yeah, they have some serious health. Thankfully, their attack is not that high. And I have that badge. I, I think that badge um, is going to be really, really useful. I can't name the badge because I forgot the name off the top of my head. Well, there we go. But uh, yeah, that's gonna that's gonna be really useful. And if I can stack that, I don't know if there's other badges like it, but if I can stack that badge, that would be amazing. All right, so let's deal with this guy. You know why? <laughs> Once again, why am I jumping on him? Why am I not hammering him? I don't know. My hammer is so much more powerful right now. In this coming chapter, I'm going to get to my jump improvement, but for the moment, I'm actually not going to. Okay, I believe there's a secret room sort of thing going on. Yeah. Okay, do I go down there? Okay, well, all right. Um, let's hammer this guy. See, multi bounce isn't gonna work so well here. So yeah, let's hammer this guy on the ground. Oh, nice. Gonna get a power up right here. Spell will increase attack power. Nice. Five. Five damage. That is what I want. All right, let's get this guy on the ground. Wait, that didn't get him on the ground. Ooh, that's three. Okay. Let's deal with this guy first. With this Gloomba. All right. Dealt with. Let's move on to the flying Goomba. Gloomba. Okay, get on the ground. And I missed the action command, but I didn't need it. Actually, probably didn't put through the action command because I didn't need it. Oh, what? 
I didn't know that we have... There's another... Super block? Okay. Um... I guess I'm gonna upgrade Goomberio. <laughs> That's fine with me. Okay. Alright, so everybody's upgraded. Um, I guess I have to go in this pipe. And I think... Unless I can go further... Oh. Okay. Oh boy, I really just did that. Okay. Let's do this properly. Why don't I have Goomberia? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to change members here. Let's go for Cooper. It'll make more sense. And I can't get that defense at all. I'm missing that completely. Um, all right, let's change, use PowerShell, see where we are from there. Okay. It takes out one guy. And this only has, he only has three maximum attacks, so I'm gonna take the chance, and I got it well. All right, six star points. Ooh, I want that heart. All right. Um, where, did, where does this pipe go? I don't actually know. Okay. Those are super blocks. So we're gonna go back up here. <laughs> All right. Let's jump up here. I believe this pipe will take us where we want to go. I think. It should. Yeah. Alright. We're good. Let's use that spin. The spin will speeds us up a little bit. Alright, so. Um We need to head back. I believe, is it here? Yes, it's right here. Okay, there was a ghost right there. There was a boo. Yep, I saw it. There's another one. It's over there. Right there. The other way. It's, it's a ghost, and he's, it looks like a butler. <laughs> it's a butler ghost. Okay, um, so he's a gatekeeper, but he's too afraid to go in here. Okay, I need regen, regen. I need some more help and some more FP, please. I really, I want to get to the, that other badge, but it's too expensive. So, Dodge Master. Makes the action command work more frequently. So it increases the timing. That would be really useful along with the other. But I bet it's expensive. Like as in badge points and in money. Alright, um, yeah, the toad thing is right here. Uh, we're going to go into the forest. I don't know how long we're going to continue the episode once we get in there. But we are going to at least enter the forest. So... Anyway, let's go ahead and do that. All right, so let's jump back out. Okay, <coughs> excuse me. Let's run back down here. Let's use spin. Spin's so much better. All right, now the forest is, um, it's one of those, they have a name, they have a name. I don't know what their name is though, but there is um, a name for it. It just got really dark, and that's a boo. Pardon me, sir. Would you happen to be Mario? How do you do, sir? My master wishes to see you. If you would, please call on us at the mansion on the far side of Forever Forest. You get the picture. You get the picture. 
my master would also like me to add that she has in her possession important news regarding the star spirits. Okay. All right. And if you don't come, we'll get you. Boo. So we have to go now. But if we don't want to, we can walk back here. Or we can walk this way. Anyway. All right. We're going to run into the forest. Um, depends on how well this goes. The Invincible. With parentheses. Tubba blubba. So, yeah. Chapter 3. All right. So we're in. Now, Forever Forest, Toad Town. Now here's the thing. The only way to make it through the forest is um, to look at the flowers. The flowers that have eyes and kind of move around like these will actually um, help you out. Okay, so you have to look for slight, I mean, it's 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 the flowers in this first. Excuse me, it's the flowers in this first place. Cooper does not understand at all how the thing works. Who is this? Yeah. Uh. No, thank you. <coughs> okay. Okay. So we have to pay really close attention to our surroundings. Okay, so the areas around the correct paths will always look slightly different from the others. Okay, so we need to look at the inner trees for this one. Okay, we'll spot strange glowing eyes. Okay, they, they really actually help us out a lot here. So, <laughs> yeah, the game's pretty much telling us what we have to look for. And there are fuzzies. Always exciting. All right, so we need to look for those eyes. Once we activate the gate, we're good. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah. I really I hate these guys. Alright, um is there something to get rid of these guys real fast, please? A snowman. You know what? I'm just gonna power shell them with Cooper. They're not gonna like that so much. And we'll just use the snowman doll. <laughs> I'm hoping to fight very few enemies here. So that's a big snowman. And he's jumping all over them. That's nice. Alright, so <laughs> that is nine star points. Not too bad. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say we only got one. Alright, uh you can actually you can actually escape the um the enemies just by standing near the gate except I messed myself up when the the game actually walks you through the gate further but as long as you stand really close to the gate I believe you can't actually be attacked I'm gonna need to test that we'll test that which probably means I'll have to find more enemies but this guy multiplies Wow really he multiplies. Alright, um multi bounce. This is where multi bounce is gonna be so useful once I get my attack power up higher. <laughs> it's not so good being that it's so low right now. Ooh, there's a defense. Nice. It's hard, but it's possible. All right, so we need to take these guys out at the same time or as close to the same time as possible. Otherwise, they'll just regen and we'll have a problem. So let's get rid of this guy. Nice. All right, nine star points again. And now I can actually show you. Because of that, you couldn't see the eyes, but you can. Wait, this might actually be the wrong gate. Was I about? Yeah, I was about to walk walk, walk through the wrong gate. <laughs> Good thing I actually walked back outside. All right. So in this one, we need to look for um, four flowers instead of three. All right. So there's three flowers on this bush. 
Um, there's actually... Oh, good evening. How are you doing? Okay. So he doesn't tell us the answer here, which I'm glad for. But yeah, you can see four flowers. All right, so that's the difference here. So we're gonna keep going. Um, let's walk through. Now, oh no, fuzzy, okay. All right, there's actually a way to get into the middle here. And there is a um, dude. <laughs> Yeah, there's a bubble or bulb or, or no, it's not a bulb or a Pikmin. Anyway, uh, he's gonna give us a magical seed. Um, I believe we have to get multiple ones of those. Okay, so let's see. We need to go. Let's. I believe it's this way. Is it this way? Yeah. Okay. It's the scary face in the tree. Um, need to go through here all right so not much further now um, okay there's actually a little secret here um, if you go into this gate you can get an HP plus badge I believe oh okay hold on a moment I might have walked through the wrong gate. Did I walk through the wrong gate? Please. Did I? I don't think I did, actually. Whew, okay, I didn't. All right, so HP plus badge, um, is it worth it? <laughs> I don't know. Damage dodge is so useful. Um. I don't think it's worth it right now, but I think perhaps it should be soon. All right, so um, so we need to take the exit now with the beehive under it. That's the unusual one. Um, this guy is not, okay. All right, so we need to get back on track. So we're gonna go walk through here. Um, so it's this way now. And uh, here you're looking for, there are more mushrooms in the background than the others. So let's just walk around. Actually, it's this one. Yeah, okay. I guess, yeah, okay, never mind. It was that one. Um, getting confused here. And that's the point. But anyway. All right, so uh, I believe these disappear. It's, it's getting more difficult here, guys. All right, guy. Okay, and these stay. Okay, so that's the difference here. It's getting more difficult. Um, but yeah, that's the difference there. Okay, another quick detour. Um, we need to head to the exit on the opposite side of the entrance. So let's walk around. Ooh, that was close. So we need to jump through here. Yeah, see, those fuzzies can't quite get you, thankfully. Okay, fuzzy. Don't do this. <laughs> Don't do this. Keep running. I believe I'm protected in here. No, I'm not. Great. That's not good. All right, I need to hit the box. There we go. Grab FP plus. Keep running. Come on, really? Really? All right, perfect time to show. I'm protected because I have the exclamation point, I think. Um. I'm protected. I'm not sure how that works precisely, but it does. Okay, we need to look for flowers. One of the entrances should have flowers. Maybe not. Hold on a moment. That's not making any sense. Okay. 
Uh, hold on. There should be flowers somewhere. <laughs> okay, I guess I decided to hit the guy. Wow, okay, there's a lot of people here. Um, let's... I wonder if that dizzy shell would work. Hmm. Because that would be so useful. I'm going to try it. Here we go. I've never done this. Okay, um... Dizzy three rounds. All right, nice. I will take that. Fuzzies look really weird when they're dizzy. All right, I can't do a multi-bounce, so I'm just gonna keep hammering the first guy, I guess. The first fuzzy. Is it a forest fuzzy? I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure what their name is. Is I assume they have a name, right? I mean, I know it's a fuzzy. Anyway, I guess we're not gonna find out. All right, put that to good use. Yes, all right, so we just have that one guy, that one prana plant, and he is easy to take care of. And we are almost to another level. That sounds good. Okay, um, got something coming here, smell increases, the smell. The spell increases the number of coins you win, which lags the Wii a little bit. Okay. All right, so we need to take, there should be flowers, which is confusing me greatly. I don't, I'm supposed to be able to select one of these? Okay. Because I'm, I, we're really close to the exit, guys, so hang with me. We're going to get this figured out. Oh, okay, perfect. All right, so we're back through. Now we just need to take the exit that's near the sign. Oh, jumped right on me. Right on top of my face. All right, multi-bounce. There's just, there's no way to get these guys out of the way fast. That sleepy sheep, it's just been sitting in my inventory. I'm gonna try it, we're gonna see what happens here. Because that was really useful last round. Okay, it works for all but one. So I guess we're just gonna do um, normal, normal thing. Blocked. Nice. All right. Let's do this. Um, this isn't going to be a very interesting round unless I can get some good hits on these guys. Let's use a refresh and then uh, use the big shell, the multi shell. All right. Unless I use a dizzy shell. You know, I can use one of each. Do those stack, however? I don't know if those stack. So I'm gonna go with that. Okay, I'm gonna change again. Do a power shell again. I believe that'll take care of them. Is that true? Fuzzies? Gone. All right, nice. And that is going to put us just one star point from the limit one star point from a level all right so we're looking for a sign i have a feeling there's another guy here isn't it yes i didn't even see him where was he ah okay um i'm saying heart points are fine so i'm just gonna start smacking these guys Force fuzzy, yeah, it's a force fuzzy, that's what I thought. All right, so I'm just gonna start hitting the force fuzzies and hope for the best here. There's a block, come on, come on. There's another block, can I get a last one? Yes, all right. The piranha takes three damage. 
which is gonna put me down fast if I just let him stay alive. So, I really need to get, get moving here. All right, this is really running to be a long episode, which is fine. Oh, that was early. Thankfully, I don't, I don't think that piranha can poison me. I don't believe. I might be wrong about that though. Not sure. All right. Come on. Oh, he got me. All right, three, three points out, but he's about to die. Just a moment. Let's get rid of him. All right. And that's gonna put me over. So 11 and choices. Um, BP was gonna give me, I think more choices because I can go HP or FP because of those two badges. All right, so let's go down. Um, I'm gonna go, <clears throat> I'm gonna go with HP I suppose, yeah. All right, and here's the sign. So we're headed to Boo's Mansion. And there's Boo's Mansion. So we're getting a little bit sidetracked, I believe. <laughs> it, it seems like we're getting sidetracked, at least. I don't know, this is our actual objective? You know? I don't know. It's just, it doesn't seem like our objective. Seems like we're getting sidetracked. I don't know. And is the butler? Yes, the butler. The butler boo. All right, welcome sirs and madame. Madame. What? Do I have a madame? Okay, I'm pleased you made it through for Forever Forest. My master waits you in the room highest up in this lovely mansion. Okay. Let's go to the third floor. Okay. Uh. I have a madame. Stand by. Oh, bombette. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Right, forgot about Bombette. I suppose she's a bomb, though. I mean, anyway, all right, that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. Let me know what you think in the next episode, where you are going to enter Boo's mansion and uh, see what's up. Apparently, they know about the Star Spirits, and I guess they're gonna help us. I don't know. We're gonna see what happens. So anyway, in the next episode, wait, what's over here? Uh, don't know what that is. Maybe we'll find out in the next episode.